Altitude economy is economic activities using flight vehicles within airspace below a thousand meters, including passenger transport, delivery, surveying, and rescue operations. China has one of the fastest growing low altitude economy. At China Plus 2025, chemicals and machinery exhibitors have tapped into this emerging economy. Let me show you. Cross Methay is exploring the use of technologies such as high pressure raising transfer molding in low altitude economy. The China team in Cross Methay has successfully adopted this technology in battery casings in the low altitude economy. At the booth, Cross Methay also presents its lightweight solutions such as PUR and color form supporting high energy efficiency in low altitude economy. At the extrusion machinery zone, Guangdong Simichen debuted its first PI film production line at China Plus 2025. PI film features excellent resistance to extreme temperature and radiation, as well as providing excellent insulation, aiming for high-end application, including the low altitude economy. At the Chemicals and Raw Material Zone, Akema offers its Capstan PEKK material. It is reinforced with carbon fibers, providing rigidity same as some metals but just half the weight. It is suitable for rigorous applications like aerial space and aviation. At Akama's booth, it also shows its Rilson PA11. It is lightweight and fully recyclable suitable for EVTOLs in low altitude economy. At the same zone, local material supplier Sinolo New Materials shows its PHA new energy film for energy storage for drones. PHA is the core material for lithium battery packaging. It is wear resistance, puncture resistance and impact resistance. It's really strong. As an emerging area, low altitude economy attracts innovations in plastics, chemicals, and machinery. High performance and lightweight appears to be key to develop solutions for this area. Let's wait and see the future development of this promising market.